Howdy, I'm Gary, Dillon Precision's Human Manual. I'm here to discuss tech tips for the Super 1050 Dillon's High Speed Progressive Reloader. On occasion, it's inevitable that a primer will stick to the end of the depriming pin. When that happens, the old primer is pushed out of the primer pocket, but because the anvil inside the spent primer is wedged under the tip of the depriming pin, it gets pulled partway back up into the primer pocket. Then the shell plate advances and the swage rod reseats the old fired primer back into the case. In order to reduce the instances of this occurring, all you need to do is just dress up the tip of the depriming pin. So first, unscrew the decapping assembly out of the top of the die. Okay. There's two schools of thought. If it suddenly occurs after you've been depriming successfully for a long time, check the tip of the depriming pin for burrs or sharp edges. Use medium to fine grit sandpaper, just pinch it and smooth off any sharp square edges on the tip of the pin. The alternative is if you take a file and flatten that tip which effectively makes the tip of it wider so that it's too wide for the anvil of the old primer to get stuck onto it. Either one seems to work. Try and figure out which works best for you. It will vary with different brands of primers as well. Some have more degree of incidence than others do.